My name is Devin, and I'm a senior developer at Expression. We have created a fully customizable cloud-based CMS and e-commerce platform. What I would like to do today is take you through some of the core concepts and architecture of our platform so you can get an idea of how Expression can help you build your next great digital experience. So, what is Expression? Expression is a fully customizable cloud-based CMS and e-commerce platform. Expression incorporates a suite of user-friendly tools for you and your clients to manage forward-facing web content. Built on top of our rich API layer, we allow developers full access to directly manage and orchestrate all Expression functionality. All of this is fully hosted, keeping you free from infrastructure-related headaches. Every feature is fully manageable from our browser-based graphical user interface, including a browser-based IDE that lets you work anywhere you have access to a browser. Finally, Expression is an extremely deep product, used by both small teams and large. It is the result of 15 years of development and refinement, a solution dealing with the real day-to-day -day challenges of web development, and has been used to develop everything from brochure sites to full-scale enterprise digital solutions for some of the world's major brands. So let's look at some of the more technical details of how Expression actually goes about rendering content. In this case, we are going to look at a simple content management request. What happens is the user navigates to a URL on the front end of your website. The URL will match against the sitemap, which determines the appropriate template element to render the content for that page. When element rendering begins, the first thing that Expression does is evaluate any of the attached data sources. The attached data sources are effectively adapters into either Expression's internal API or any external service you wish to integrate. When the data is returned to the element, it is then fed through any SSJS processors attached to the data source. These are simple JavaScript files that can perform data transformation on whatever data is received from the API. After the scripting layer has completed, we now have an element context. This feeds the actual handlebars or HBS template and is used to emit the final formatted content. This is typically used to generate HTML, but could also be used to generate JSON, for example, if the developer wants to create their own custom API on top of Expressions API. Finally, after rendering is complete, the result is sent to the user's browser. If you are interested in learning more about Expression, I highly recommend checking out our website, where you will find full general, developer, and API documentation available to give you an even better idea about the true power of the platform we have built.